Hi everyone, welcome to the 10th video of my Pillars of Eternity Beta Let's Play using a modded party. So in the previous video I made some progress on the Blood Legacy quest. When I was in the Eastern Cave in Deerford Crossing, uh, you can see here from the details uh, that I found a corpse carrying a note and a skull handle key. That gave me reason to believe that uh, Triggle had been up to something, so I paid him a visit and he basically attacked me. Uh, we don't know what he was hiding still, but we found an underground uh, ruin and uh, the symbol of skein or skein in this uh, ruin. So basically, what I could have done is maybe tried to find that ogre first in that uh, eastern cave to corroborate uh, Triggle's story about uh, Elise. But I didn't do that because I actually want to level up before I go and meet the ogre. I do want to try and kill the ogre. And I could probably do with leveling up at another level. I'm not sure if um, my party's strong enough to take the ogre down or not. Probably is since I have a wizard. I've tried this before without a wizard and uh, it's pretty hard to uh, take on the ogre and the ogre's friends if uh, you don't have uh, a caster in your party. But um, what I'm going to do now is go through this ruin a bit. I'm hoping to find a grappling hook. And then maybe we'll go back to try and complete the nest egg. See if uh, a grappling hook will allow me to get the egg down in one piece. If I can complete one of these quests, it will give me enough experience to level up. It's probably yeah, the only way I'm going to be able to level up is by completing one of them. Most of the experience you get in the game is from doing quests, although you get a small amount from uh, finding places on the map and uh, a small amount from completing the bestiary as well. Right, let's unpause and uh, no problem. get moving there. Okay, so it looks like there's some fungus here. I haven't changed around some of my character's inventory as well for a while. It says fine robe, DR5, it says DR7, what does that currently have? You know what, I think that's not a bad replacement, so let's just put that there. Okay, what's that? No hatchet. Some of these potions I would probably never use, so I should probably sell them, but I'm not too concerned with doing that in this beta. In a full game, I'd be going to the shop and selling them and upgrading my items, but there's not much point in the beta. Uh, small shield. I could use a small shield with the chanter as well to increase his accuracy. I'm not sure if it would increase his accuracy for <coughs> spells and that, or just his weapons. I do like having high deflection with him now. Okay, what's that? Major recovery. Okay, put that there. Right on it. It'd be really nice to have some music in the game as well. I can't wait for that when a full game is released to just when there's sound effects but no real music yet right so there's wood beetles uh, let's change my formation as well let's get her up front yeah. is everyone reloaded recently? Select. Right, she has it. Oh. Did I not have her on scout? Okay. Um. Right. Beetles, are they poison? I can't remember. Let's stick it on Willing Fortitude. And attack that there. Wizard can attack there. She can attack there. Uh, 
Can I hobble that in time? Probably not, but let's try it. Fighter can move up to there. Okay, maybe I can. Help. Okay, it looks like I killed it. See and not be seen. Right, still overloading. Good. Right, we found another one. Start to be spotted there. I think same again here. Let's hobble. Uh, Chanter can attack. She can attack. Wizard can attack. Well, if it can get itself into range. Right, it's doing corrosive. Chanter. Right, that increases our fortitude. This isn't a ranged area of effect, it's only against one target. Okay, did it miss? No, I hit the all in fighter sadly. Okay, kill that. My eyes are peeled. Yeah, I lost three health then. Let's take a look at that. Crit symbol has been painted on this canvas in streaks of something that looks like blood. Uh, let's take that would be tall. Eh? Sure. In there. I haven't even I haven't tried out using a trap yet. I probably should do it at some point. I think that's something I'd probably sell a lot in the main game. Okay. Now, who has the best mechanic? Yes, so it does. As you wish. Let's pull them back. Yes, I'll take care of it. Okay, no trap. We found a camping supply, but I think I've capped out that, so I can't take it. Yeah, no problem. Might be able to pick it up later. Okay, right, more beetles, stone beetles. Hopefully they don't cause a bug issue. Right, she's getting sighted. I don't think I can uh, come down here any more than that. What is it? Oh. Indeed. Huh? Sure. Right, stay full reloaded, I believe. Let's check. Bestiary, remind ourselves. So they're weak. A reflex and will attacks and to corrode attacks. I think. Not sure what type of attacks there's counter, so it might attack with fortitude. Chant has probably got the best fortitude. Um, Score, I assume, or maybe the Paladin. 44. 44, but he's a dwarf, so he's immune to poisons and that. Paladin's very good defense, is actually, apart from deflection, is not amazing. Right, let's hobble that. Shoot that. Shoot that. The wizard's probably out of range there, so I'll let it come closer. Okay. Okay, there's an Adra Beetle there, not good. Let's try using that. Right, who do I think he's attacking? I don't know. Maybe the fighter. Let's go ahead and knock down the Adra Beetle if I can. Um. Should probably move these apart a bit actually. Or I'm gonna get shocked. Right. 
It looks as if he's going for the fighter, I think, but I can't be definitely sure. It could be the paladin. It looks like it's along that line, doesn't it? Um, okay, did I cast that off? I did. Right, I don't think that interrupted it, though. Right, let's use blind on that. Attack that. She can attack that. Can attack that still. Can try and knock that down. Ooh, that's not good. The wizard was just in range. I wasn't expecting that. Looks like the stone beetle burrowed over there as well. Uh, my wizard's pretty wrecked then. I kind of need to bring him back. Don't. Do any of these? It's a bit late for that now, to be honest. I don't really have any immediate endurance bonus apart from using my own staff, which I guess I could use. I think this is buggy at the moment, though, to be honest. Uh, he should be okay. It's just that. Uh, Chanter, okay. Let's try and use that. Right, he's going in there anyway. I'll use a knockdown. Right, they can all aim at him still. Where's the paladin? Paladin should be in the middle, really. Okay, health is back up a lot. Right, let them fire off one more round and then probably engage in combat with some of them. Right, the rogue hit there. It's just that. Forty-eight, nice. Oh, uh, let's use that. More of them, jeez. Just another one. Fight is getting a bit wrecked. Do I have any potions I can use? Endurance. Uh, should be okay. Alright, where's that going to? That's the thing. Hopefully not next to my fighter. Right. Right, she's gone to there. I have to bring my chanter in here, I think. Let's just go and attack that. Let's get her forward. Support. There, and attack. Andrew Beetle, take that down. Um, I think I'll bring her nearer to the Paladin to get the bonus before I fire. Make sure. I oh, too late. Now I'm running forward. Right, kill that. Good. Let's use Fighter to attack that. Use Chanter for that attack. So. I think I target both of those two. She can switch out. Attack that there. It's a waste of doing nothing. Attack that there. Right, that's dead. That's nearly dead. Okay, do we have a knockdown left? No, we don't. Right, you just had to daze it. Use. Right, have I used all of my abilities? Pretty much. Don't want to use any spells. I hang on to them. I think I just used that, didn't I? Yes. Spot on. On. Well. 
Okay. Huh? Right, be back in huh? here, let's see. Sure. For some reason. We find ten. A blade in the dark. Sure. Okay. Huh? Let's check up here. Like there's a wall and perhaps something beyond it, but I can't go through there. Right, so how are we looking for damage? Not terrible, but you might have to be a bit careful with the wizard. There's a doorway over there. And nothing over there. Okay. Right, we spotted something a skin mind breaker. Which, not sure what that is, cipher maybe? Let's bring it forward without getting caught. Yes. Yes. Something there as well. Skin Temple Guard, Skin Temple Fanatic. Um, I could try and bring in everyone, or I could just block the doorway. Oh shit, right. What's that? Cultist, Temple Guard, Fanatic. I wish you would tell you what these, what exactly they are, like say, Barbarian and Brackets, somewhere on that uh, uh, icon, or you know, whatever class they really are. Yeah. No pro. For human opponents, it doesn't actually update oh. the bestiary. Okay, let's make sure if these weapons are reloaded. Uh, let's put down chant one. Okay, looks like the rogues are loading, and everyone else is okay. Yes, I'll take. Let's move in. Uh, rogue. Take care of it. Chant forward as well. Yes. As you wish. Okay, right. Let's use Equipment and strike on him. Dwarf chanted to attack that there. Pa the Paladin can attack there as well. Hopefully, I'm not sure they can all see here actually. The wizard's probably out of range. Is that dead? Yes, it is. Right, that skin cultist is doing something. Probably casting. Um, let's bring the fighter into there. Oh, just appeared then. Right, let's knock you down. Busy, supposedly. I think I'll bring a chanter up to get some more room here. Damn, that's about to cast. Oh, not sure who against. Let's, um,. Pull back here just in case is it a scenario of effect. Okay. I 
think I'll pull that one back to let the f engage the fight the first. Right. Okay. Now I'll bring it forward. Looks like a pillar type thing, which isn't very good. Um, let's attack there. You can attack there. Let's get Chanter in there. Uh, I could change my chant to reflex. That probably would work against it, but I probably wouldn't have enough time to chant to. That's casting something. I might go and use my chanter against that, actually. Problem is, there could be other people down here, but they're going to risk it. Yeah, that's a pillar. So, pillar of faith, 20... Right, it's effects reflex, 36 crush damage. What's who? That's quite a few effects going on there. Let's use my paladin to use liberating exhortation. I should uh, delay some of those. I think I've got the wrong chant on anyway here. It's got the fortitude ones. Let's put that one on. That barbarian's got carnage, which will mean it affects people around it. I think that's friends it's using. Actually, let's use that here. Is that down to? Don't know. Uh, she can. She cast that on the. Right, she's just done that then, so all of those are temporarily stopped. Let's attack cultist. Again with her. Okay, he can use that again. Could use some spells, but I'm going to save on them. Uh, that's. I nearly chant there. Is that dead yet? No. Let's attack there. Oh, this voice is intent on coming into the room, so right, I'll let him. Let's attack there. There, attack. There. Let's bring Paladin forward so I get some more aura bonuses. Where the hell are you going? Oh, it's not on rods. That's it. Attack that there. So it got no. It's not got your aura bonus. Let's move it a bit closer. Right, dead good. I haven't got a yeah, I've got a knockdown left, so let's use that. Right, let's use uh I'll do a summon for a change there, oops. Switch the pike out. Fight forwards. Get attack in there. Crowhawk. Okay. Ooh, there's another one coming in there. Not good. Let's. I think he's attacking the uh, phantom now, so we'll actually reposition the chant in a minute. Well, it looks like he might be going for them anyway. Right, that's fine by me. Let him attack the phantom. Right, let's use a knockdown, but who cares if it attacks the phantom? Right. 
let's see, I might well just kill that. Wizards can attack that. They can move on to whomever they like. Well, Paladin will place there. Let's get you in here. Dead. Let's tack that there. Almost. Switch that over. Okay, right, there's a chest up there, so in the dark. go back on scouting. Sure. And I'll what use the it? wizards uh, to pick up all this loot. So I think I'll put it all in stash and figure out what it is later. And it, oh, trap detected. Let's cancel that. So it's actually on the chest. So let's use them, that to. Uh, you cannot disarm the trap. Do you wish to trigger it? No, I do not. So that's surprising. My mechanics at eight, so it's a really high level trap. So I'm gonna have to leave that, I think, unless I want to take the damage. Eh? Maybe when I'm leaving the dungeon, I can uh, no problem. trigger it on purpose to get whatever's inside it. Right. Let's yes. Of course. Go down here. Okay, right, probably should have used someone who can actually scout a bit. Let's move back. Now uh, we've actually de detected a trap there. So I probably shouldn't go through there. Um, could attack into it and let them come through. I think what we're going to do is come over this side though. Something down there as well. Can I close what the is it? door? Of yeah. course. No problem. Okay. That's a fungus or something there. Another guy down here. Yeah, got it. Right, three of them. Now I can't, for the life of me, remember which one the sentries are. Cultists or the cultist one. Uh, we've got a temple guard there as well. It's a pretty big chat. And oh, another one. Skin temple guard. I guess I could try and disarm that trap rather than go through here. And I can't disarm this trap either by the looks of it. Right, so forget that idea. Right, it's gonna have to eh? come over here. Got it. So it's not as if I haven't got low low mechanics. You have to have really you have to really specialise in your skills in this game. It appears. Huh? 
Sure. Yeah, right. Let's make sure everything's reloaded. Oh. Yes, as you wish. Okay, I think they're all reloaded. So eh? should come back there. Yes. Holding certainly. some more in the middle. Mm. Fights can come no down problem. there. Yeah. Right. Chant can go there. Let's put it off fast mode. And what is that? Cultist. Right, I think I'll let's attack cultist. Like to attack the wizard type ones first, so I think that might be a wizard of some sort or a cipher or I don't know. Uh, let's use attack that. She can use hobble. Wizard can do. There's three of them there actually. Maybe I should do one of these. Probably wouldn't be an awful idea. It's just slicking, is it? I don't think you can see there though. Let's put that forward into the room. Oh, he's casting something. Those two are both rogues, the sentries are. Let's see, I must try and knock him down if I can't kill him. Yeah, that's a problem. He's going to cast that. Pillar of whatever. Let's get the chant involved here to get that guy instead. Then there's another sentry slash rogue there. Right, it's another cultist there. See in time. Yeah, brilliant. Right, so that worked. Right, sentries switch over to the bows. Right, let's get see if I can cast something here. So I think hobbles them. Doesn't do any damage though. Ball of flame isn't gonna do much good. Don't think I wanna use that. Good old chill fog, I think could be pretty good here, so just that there. Have to move forward a bit though. Another rogue type character there. Right, I'm gonna go for the cultist, I think, here. Ah, oh, there's another one. Another temple guard. Um Maybe I'll hand him back then. Can I kill this cultist? I'm not sure. Right, he just healed them. Wow, there's quite a few of them coming in. Call him fighter. He's not near enough to use that. It's a pretty big combat coming up here. Let's attacking that cultist who's been healed up now. I'll switch back to gun for a second. Okay, that sentry wants to get involved here actually, so let's go and attack him. Now. Blinded. Right, let's use the Paladin's ability there. Uh, I could probably use the Wizard to use another. Might be a good idea to use another spell here. Um. Twelve meter spell. D 
this is area of effect, so it includes my own guys. If I just have to be a bit careful. Let's use that there. Don't think that will include the fighter. Right. Let's blind that one. Okay. Start slash right. Don't know what that is. It's a knockdown. That's not good. Using a pillar, not good. Okay, uh, she can keep on firing on the cultists. We've got three of them, I'm really to take them down. Right, so that should damage them quite a bit. Might use another one of those in a minute. Chill effect came in again. Um, let's try and take that one down. Right, he's moved into that. Good. Wizard. Let's bring him forward. Uh, what effect is that? Right, so be a bit careful not to go in that range effect I think this can attack there attack there again okay a lot of them are damaged but I haven't killed them yet let's how many f cultists have they got left fanatic Um, move back there, this is a bit safer. Right, I think I took one down. Two sentries, temple guards, temple sentry, temple fanatic. I think I'll attack the range guys first then. I think I've taken down all the spellcasters. Let's take down that one as well, and that one can also take that one down for the time being. Right, he's dead, nice. That one can take down that one then. And the wizard can go for that. Rogue. I'll switch over. She can attack that there. Right, the chill fog came into effect again. How are these guys doing? I've forgotten all about the enchanter, so let's use there. I, think I might have missed one then. One two. Three. Right, took a few down. Rogue's coming in. Let's bring the paladin in. Uh, how are these looking? Right, none of those are in effect. Let's take down that. Take that down. Let's use all the special effects. Fighter, let's knock you down. Okay, hopefully I can kill that before it comes into effect. Yep. Don't think I switched that over, did I? Okay. I think I'll probably use all my special effects now, let's just attack it. Um, none of those are in effect. Took it down. Okay, that was a pretty Time tough to combat that I think, but it's come out of it pretty well.
Hi everyone, this part of the recording isn't actually an original part of the recording. I'm recording this a couple of days later. In between that time, there's actually been a new patch that has come out for the Bacchus Beta. It's supposedly going to be the last patch before the full release of the game. Now that patch has added quite a few nice things. You can hear in the background music has actually been added, added to the game. It might be a bit loud actually. There's also new things like new portraits. It's actually messed up one of mine though sadly. And there's been lots of balance fixes in the main new sound effects and um, yeah small changes basically. Now that's really great but the problem is it's kind of messed up old save game files including this one. Now you can't see too many problems here uh, but there is the old one. Uh, they've actually changed backgrounds so some of my character stats are a bit different now. Uh, Rawatai improves condition instead of intelligence these days. The biggest problem I've encountered is on Div for Crossing. That map is completely messed up. There are things all over the place where they shouldn't be. And um, yeah, I think I'm probably going to have to call it an end of this Let's Play at this point because certain things are messed up so much. Not sure what it's like on this map, but uh, yeah, it's um, definitely messed up elsewhere. Now, what I could do is a number of different things at this point, and I kind of need your feedback on this. I could just stop recording videos for Pillars of Eternity until the full release of the game on 26th of March. Or I could maybe start a new party. I could maybe play up to this point and continue on uh, from here with that new party. Probably be slightly different. Or I could start to make some character build videos. Now I'm actually needs, needing the mod that I've been using with this Let's Play to do that probably. I can only actually create characters up to level 8 without the mod. There's a cap currently on the beta. So I'm not sure when that mod is due to come out, if it's going to come out at all. Maybe a few days though, I'll have to check the forums. Or I could maybe make a video or two about what's been changed in the new uh, backer beta, which is going to be pretty much identical to what things are like in the full release. So you have to let me know in the comments what you think I should do, basically, if you have an opinion on that. So if this is the end of this Let's Play at this point, I'd just like to thank you for watching. I hope you'll check out my full Pillars of Eternity Let's Play when that's out, probably a day or two after the release on the 26th of March. And um, yeah, that's it. So thank you for watching again, and I'll see you next time.